Is she, am I here? Maybe? We good? The fuck? <laughs> Welcome back. Hi! Yay! Okay, that is good to see. Okay, hi. I don't know what happened. Um, I think it was probably the internet. OBS said I was live. Uh, obviously, I was not. And then I noticed all of a sudden the PlayStation was like, Overwatch successfully installed. And I was like, bitch, get off the internet. So I unplugged the LAN. Oh, why is my connection flashing red again? Anyway, we hope it holds. I unplugged the ethernet from the PlayStation, so hopefully it doesn't suck it down. Um, thank you for your patience. Um, <laughs> yay. <laughs> anyway, uh, you didn't miss anything other than I burnt, like, another marshmallow. So we're just gonna... Gonna try. Looks fine, no stutters. Perfect, thank you. See, I always hate it when I lose it and I'm not notified. Ah, ah, ah! Shit, shit, no, 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 oh my god. Bungie, is this how I'm supposed to play the game? Oh my gosh, I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous, I don't want to mess anything up. <laughs> I hope I haven't... I'm, I'll talk to this person at some point. I just want to roast a good one. Space campfire simulator. Is it golden yet? As mentioned, I won't be around for long bitrate. Oh, Jesus. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. Okay, that marshmallow actually looks really good. Um, why are we tanking right now? Why are you doing this to me? Yeah, something's bugging my internet. I'm gonna sit here for a second. Stare at it. Why? Why is my bitrate 720? Oh my god, I don't know what's going on. Can you even see me? Can you guys, like, say something if you can see me okay? This is the worst. Why is... Okay, now we're going back up. But not much. Bitrate wants to 422. It looks fine right now. All right. I will... I will progress slowly. That marshmallow looked good. Um, stream looks fine. All right, thank you. Yeah, it's getting better. It's... The bitrate's only 12. It was down to 420. You're not wrong. Um... Talk to Slate. Wait, hold on. There's music when I do certain things. Okay. Marshmallows. Wait, I have feet. I'm tall. Okay. Here we go. There's our pilot. Back from your pre-launch camp out under the stars, I see. Are we talking psychically or something? Because your mouth isn't moving. So it's launch day. Seems like only yesterday you joined the space program and suddenly here you are, leaving on your first solo voyage. What do you say? Ready to get this beauty off the ground? It's fueled up and ready to go. You're sure you fixed the retro rockets? That was only a problem one time. Eh, and then maybe a few times after that, but hey, no reason to dwell on the past, right? Anyway, you'll need to get the launch codes from Hornfells at the observatory before you can lift off. Just bring those here once you said your goodbyes, or whatever. Launch codes from Hornfell at the observatory. Uh, marshmallows might want to have your normal camera position this because you're blocking off words. Okay. Stop this. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <gasps> Look at my shadow. Look at, I'm walking with my- Ah! 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 Did I do something wrong? What did I do? Okay. Ah! Hey. Fire bad! Fire bad. <laughs> hey. What's this do? Woo! I meant to buy... Man, I might buy this after you finish today and finish in time for next stream. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, that feels so good. The auditory feedback is so good. Jump. Jump. First person camera is always like... F with me for a little bit. Ooh. Um... What? Oh! Oh, so tiny! Talk to Micah. Hey, 
Hey, it's you! Flight said you blasted off in your ship today. I'm really excited to see the launch. Aren't you going into space? Aren't you? You better not have changed your mind. I want to practice with the pro before I... Ooh. Oh, suddenly it's dark. Suddenly it's light? What? What? What that means? Yeah, we recalibrated the controls and installed better thrusters. Wanna give it a test drive? It says it's just like the real thing. Only less likely to start a fire. Try to land one of the geyser pools. Show me what you got. I don't know where this voice is coming from, but okay. Fly model ship. Oh! Oh my god! Okay, so the darkness thing was probably on purpose. Bitrate's holding at 4,500. Okay, we're good. Um... Oh! Oh! How'd I do? <laughs> L2 and R2. I, I... <laughs> okay, down and up. Down, up. Hey, look, I got somewhere. Oh my god. All right, hang on. Am I gonna fly one with people in it? <laughs> Guys, did you know that I, I'm, I'm gonna go be an astronaut someday? I'm applying to NASA. I'm gonna be an actual astronaut. How are you allowed to drive? I'm a really fucking good driver. I love rules. This has not- this is nothing like driving a car. Rude. Ah, 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 ah. Fuck. Okay, I have a goal. I have a goal. Oh, I see what the that. Nope. Nope. Wrong way, you little turd. No. Wait. Come on, recover. Other way. Other way, baby. Come on. Come on. No, oh, get out of there. Give up. <laughs> right, I have a goal. Ta da! Straight shot. Next one. Go. Easy, baby. Easy. Bring it back! Bring it back! It makes me think of something. I wonder what it is. It kind of reminds me of Mist graphically. And it's like tree houses and stuff. Reminds me of Mist a little bit. Fuck you! No. I did so good that one time! Ah! No, I want that. I'm getting a little too, like, rushed now. No, 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 no. Almost. <laughs> Those houses kind of remind me of shacks. No! Catch it! Catch it! Catch it! No! Go up, bitch! Let's see. This is how it... 
I'll try. Hobie! All right, hang on. I am gonna get that, though. What are you doing in my swamp? Try to distract me. Ooh, hold on. What the? It's because it like tips. Oh my gosh. It's the music telling me to move on. Hang on. Okay, fast is bad. Go close, I wouldn't worry about this too much. But I need to learn how to do it. You never fly third person? Dick, really? No, it, when it rolls, it's bad. So much fun. Oh! Oh! Okay, now I can't see it. The real thing is easier than this. <laughs> you know, fuck you! I'm leaving! I can't do this anymore! <laughs> I can't do it anymore! Boo you, my god! Get out of town! Lord, that was making me nauseous. The other thing with first person walking games is I tend to either be staring at the sky the whole time, or you're gonna see a lot of the ground. <laughs> Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm not where I should be. Jump! Ooh. Little movements, yeah. Do, do I- have I ever seemed subtle to you? Talk to Rutil. Actually blasting off of that thing, huh? They really don't explode as often anymore. Or I'm told my odds of survival are statistically quite high. Yes, the space programs certainly come a long way. I should probably thank you for causing fewer flash fires than your predecessors. By the way, good luck with those retro rockets. Postcards from orbit. So, things explode a lot. Ooh. This pilot seat used by pioneering astronaut Feldspar is all that remains of our inaugural flight into space. Although it's been argued such a distinction requires a breathtakingly liberal definition of flight. <laughs> That day will never less be remembered as a landmark achievement in Hearthian history. Oh, that's funny. Can I sit? No. Find and touch everything. Touch it. Touch it. Find and touch everything. Everything. Touch. Ooh, rocket. I know you. You were over there, and over there, and over there, and over there, and lots of down there. Lots of that. Ooh. Watermill. Nice. Re. What you mean, Re? So is this- this seems like a temporary settlement. I feel like they came here, erected this shit temporarily, and now they be chillin'. Marl. Ooh, this sounds familiar. Is Marl the one? I think is the one. So it's launch day, huh? How's gonna miss you? Speaking of launch day, I was thinking about it. The platform ships the ship's launch from is getting old. Isn't it time you built a new, less flammable one? That big tree in the village would be a perfect choice. I wouldn't mind helping out the space program. Just say the word. 
<laughs> Current launch pad is fine. Thanks. Nice try. We all know you have it out for that tree. Launch pad is playable. Just considering watching you play the game out. Because I am a treasure to be beheld. And I honestly won't make as much progress as you think. Um, first of all, Lumberjack Sheik looks great on these aliens. Um, this is my new favorite character. And I don't know. Might struggle with bits, I don't know. But you are so precious. I'm precious. <laughs> I curled all of my hairs today just for this. Kidding. Um, nice try. We all know you have it out for the tree. That's what I'm gonna choose. What? No. I just think it's in the way and someone ought to chop it down, you know? Specifically me. Ah, you think that has to do with the time I fell out of it? Broke my arm? That was when we were hatchlings. Who would hold a grudge for that long? Okay, so they've been here a while because he was a hatchling and he broke his arm on the tree. I'm reading into this a lot. If we can go in this house. The answer is no. I spent like a hundred hours in this game because I couldn't emotionally let it go. Okay. Ooh. It's gonna be some heavy back seating. <laughs> Honestly, not as heavy as Kyle and Kingdom Hearts. <coughs> Excuse me, a little something talking. My, caught my throat there. Caught my throat there. Talk to nice. Ness? I'm gonna say Ness. Hello there, Space Cadet. I hear you're leaving the crater today. You meet any other travelers up there? Remind them to take proper care of their instruments. Oh, shit. Tell me about the travelers' instruments. Where's the observatory? Tell me about the travelers' instruments. Oh, sure. I made all the instruments, you know? Let me see. There's church drums, Ibax banjo, and Gabro's flute. It's nice as far as I know. I don't understand how important it is for me to see someone I care about experience this as fully as possible on their own. Yeah, Bungie would let me experience it par pure. I don't know why I said poor. And Phil Spa's harmonica, of course. Though Phil Spa's been missing for a long time. Sometimes it feels like just yesterday they were playing their harmonica around the clay part. Ooh! You know what I just noticed? Is that I'm seeing that this is all gender neutral. Which is very nice. The reason I want to play, but I've already seen one to two hours of gameplay. Uh, Phil Spa and their harmonica! I, is, is this a thing I'm picking up on? Because that's also very meaningful and I love it. Um, anyway, you hear music in space. That'll be one of those space programs, other travelers. If you like company, you can always pull out your signal scope and track them down. Alright, I had another question for you. Trouble is, every time a hot in leaves for out of space, that's one less musician in our orchestra. Um, where's the observatory? Questions like that make us worried about you going up in the space on your own, you know? Observatories up the path behind the waterfall. There's a couple of sides smacking the way, but really, you just keep going up and down. Up, going up, and then hook a right when you get to the zero G cave. Okay, that'll be fucking fun. Eh, my name is Ness. Ooh. Okay, so people go on missions to leave this crater. Everything's gender neutral. And... Um, everybody's dying, and I don't know why they're here. I think is what's going on. I'm trying to be as completionist-ish as possible, which is hard for me. We're just going to touch everything. I am child at mall. I touch everything. Oh my gosh, how did I miss this guy? I'm gonna be as completionist as possible, she says. The less you see, the better. Trust me, I agree, but I feel like I've already seen too much. Talk to poor feet. Hey, yo, hatchling! Heard you're leaving us to seek adventure amongst the stars. When you return, let you, me, and Gossett open a bottle of the good stuff. Um, the good stuff is less delicious sapphire and more daunting digestive challenge. Well, let's seek adventure among. Um, the good stuff. An iron stomach is the mark of a true hearty, and my friend, a hearty hunter gatherer lifestyle stems from trial and error, by what, by which I mean our ancestors survived eating a lot of bad things. All right. Maybe I, you haven't seen nothing yet. I mean, I haven't, but I'm not going to see anything I haven't already seen in Sarah's first session. Hello, the astronaut returns. Any new dirt? I didn't, different? Okay, so different dialogue. So I should talk to people more than once. Um, hoping to teach Eska to tap trees next time when they return from Battle Rock. 
They'll bring me through the sap. I could attempt moon one. Alright. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. What are you up to? Just finished sealing up another batch of sap wine for Agent. I like to begin Agent a batch of the day of a significant occasion, you know? That's why there's so many bottles labeled Structural Collapse and House Fire. Okay, that's really funny. Um, can I go in here? No. Ooh. Am I stuck? Nope. Okay, so it's intriguing that they just let me back here. I ain't complaining. Alright, launch tower... Observatory. I originally planned to just watch the guy who was playing this with his playthrough and then wanted to play it myself. You should have just left right away. Uh, are you talking about sound? Pretty sure he played this. He played both, right? Yeah, I vaguely remember going, Hi, spoilers, bye! Yeah. <gasps> oh, they're cute. Talk to Tefra. Talk to Galena. Hello, astronaut! If it isn't our favorite troublemaker. Radio. We wanted to play hide and seek, but Moraine wouldn't let us borrow their signal scope. I don't know, the voice here is fluctuating. Because it's really delicate and not supposed to be thrown around like that. Hey, hey, can we use your signal scope? Can we, can we please we let you be it? I cannot today. Oh, really? Well, we can't play without a signal scope. Play, play with us later, okay? Okay. Uh, what age? I mean, Galena. Okay. Hey, Booster! Oh, maybe though, the, the main reason I like it is SPACE! I watch a whole playthrough and it's still so satisfying to go through yourself. I am getting so excited! I'm already really liking moving around in this world, even though it's first person, which I generally... generally can't stand. It's not my... not my first choice, but... the simplisticness, it honestly reminds me of Mist if I could control my... Like, the setup reminds me of mess. Ah! Fuck! Oh, I fucked up. 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 Okay. Okay, so, so... Almost open-world-ish in the sense that, um... I cannot count on there being guardrails. Those children are a small tutorial, by the way. I'm worried about Sarah missing the tutorials. You might- Oh! Shay! <laughs> Yelling your name, as always. As you like. You might well do the game is entirely non-linear. I checked out the other stream and the first thing they managed to get was endgame territory. Wow. What's this game? Outer Wilds. Um, I don't have an exclamation point game because I'm trash. Um, this is a space game. Thanks for yelling it. Huh. You are welcome. Hey, astronaut. What's with the radio? We want to play hide and seek, but we're able to let us borrow their signal scope. Hey, can we use your signal scope? Can we, can we please? Oh, the music signifies a tutorial. Shay, I recommend you don't watch it. Yeah, Shay, this is an emotional game, and if you ever want to play this, spoilers. Also, um, Shay, I've been thinking about you. I hope you're getting rest. I hope you're doing okay. And now I'm gonna go back to being an alien! Sure, let's play, because apparently this is a tutorial. Woohoo! Okay, here are the rules, here are the rules. Glenn and me are gonna hide with these radios, and you'll use your single scope to find us. Last one to be found wins! Okay, Clue tries to start counting. <laughs> Equip single scope. Frequency, hide and seek. Outer Wilds Ventures. Oh, okay, different frequencies. Okay, zoom in, hold. Unknown. Hang on. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Think. Yep. Hey! Bye, Bungie. The music is just atmospheric, don't worry. I'm so good at this! I'm like a pro gamer! Check me the fuck out, kids. Jump! No! No! Because it's a very much one-time experience. Oh no. Oh no. Please, super fucked up. If you all ever want to play, less the better. 
I have a feeling that you would like this, Shay. I do. It is available on Xbox, PlayStation, and Steam. Alright, where'd that little jelly bean go? Which way did he go? Waterfall. Having a little trouble with the controls. Gotcha. Alright, so I think I figured this out pretty okay. Back to smell. Uh, yeah, and it was 25 bucks, so it's not like... She says that she plummets. This is a wonderful game, but if you're likely to pay it yourself, you can't watch someone else play it first. Yeah, indie adventure story game. Um, Shay, you know, you know Tolstoy's? Like, did a playthrough offline and talked about how much she loved it. Okay, please. No, 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 no! Okay, this is tricky. Okay, in my defense, this is hard because... First person. Oh. Re, I'm annoyed at myself for watching sound play it. I saw, like, maybe an hour of sound play it, but I don't know what was going on. Yeah. Is it because I'm too precious for this world? Okay, hang on. If I'm over jumping, I should jump this way. Yes! Oh, you found me? But, but my head is falling super good. Don't forget, you have that vocals, okay? Okay, um, so I guess I'll just fucking die now then. It's cool. Don't worry about me. Galena, or is it Galena or something? What was her name? Ken. Uh, 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 uh. Somewhere. Okay, so Tefra is that way. I saw it say unknown. Tefra is directly that way. Nope. Ah, ah. I thought. Behind this house. Behind here. No. Is that just left it right tilted up and down matters too? Hmm. Interesting, not available on Steam till June 2020. Interesting. Really? Oh. Ah, ha, ha, hey, yo. Okay. Available on PC. Oh, when I say Steam, I mean PC. Um... Want to hear a funny Lady Tuesday thing? I assume that if it was available on PC, that it was Steam, because I forget that you can just buy a computer game. Graphic. There's. Vic is like 50-50. How do I get up there? They pay artists good but forced exclusives, which is thin in the modern gaming age. Observatory. Is that the observatory? Wait. Jump! Nope. I didn't do it. I'm gonna try that again. I feel like this game might be better played on PS4. But it's cheaper on PC. Um... I think I'd have better control on PC, but... I personally just like streaming on a console more. Ah ha ha ha, I gotcha, bitch! Has native controller support? Alright, dope. I can't stand them because they have zero Linux support. Meanwhile, stream is actually helping Linux get more support. 
Recommends controller, but I found mouse car keyboard far easier. Plus, you could always um, shove an Xbox controller on a computer. But for me, they aren't just forcing me to use a certain store. You literally can't play it on PC. It loads faster on PC. UOL improvements. Fish and mailed. Nice spoonerism, my friend. Me like. Fish and ram, fish and ram. Sing it helps me pass the time. Will you in the crate? Guess we'll all be a little busier without you on a little hand. Big water planet giant steep, that's where I'd go. Why? One time, after the rest of the village had left to sleep, it was just two of us sitting around the campfire. Barbara told me about the first trip to Giant Steep. The other ship easily enough in the waves. Couldn't see too far down. I had a hummock in the water it was, I guess, too dark. Ever wants to see what lay beneath the surface. So they decided to travel deeper. Go down, down. Little League Gabber couldn't go any further. I will. I was just pausing dramatically. So, exercise at a will of its own, the water was refusing to let Gabra go any deeper. Held it back, almost as if it would try to protect them from something. And then, in the terrible darkness, Gabra saw it. The tentacle of some hideous beast. <laughs> was there sap wine involved? Come to think of it, how would you have someone you should be exploring that isn't he? Alright, Spinel. Yes. Alright, we are going to the observatory and the zero G cave, and we go through the zero G cave, which sounds like it'll be a nightmare of a navigation, and we go right, I think. I'm having fun voicing all these out west settlement aliens. Fun. Ooh! There's stuff! Zero G is so well done in this game, don't worry, read. I saw smoke coming from Young Bark Crater up north and figured I should go check it out. Use the scout launcher. Please don't break it while I'm gone. Tectite. Yeah, tectite. Alright, um. So that's where we'll go last. Hi, astronaut! You know the patch of ghost matter inside this fence? Gossip said it to be used for bigger. That it used to be bigger when they were a hatchling. As ghost matter evaporates, it just takes a su su super long time to go away. I hope there's still ghost matter in the village when I'm a grown up. Ghost matter is awesome. Ghost matter is super cool. It'll burn the heck out of you. you shouldn't be throwing rocks in there. Ghost matter is dangerous. You know, ghost matter is how Tektite lost their foot, right? Whoa, really? That's so cool. That is cool as fuck. What's ghost matter? That sparkly shit? Cool. Dope, kid. Dope. All right, let's see what this is. I'm going to touch everything, everything. Her statue. That was a tutorial too? Uh, Rock throwing 101. Fine. Ooh, that was cool. Did you see that? All right. It's cool that little scouts can detect ghost matter at all, but what would be really cool is if the little scout could like shoot ghost matter at stuff all pew, 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 pew. Okay. What little scout? Are you playing on PC or console? Uh, PS4. PS4. Do not X-Bone. I fuck up? Pretty much everything in the village is a tutorial of some kind. The whole game is about gathering information. You should be a voice actor. <laughs> Thank you! For now, just my streams. Tomorrow, Pixar. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I fucked up the- whoa. That's cool. They're just sticking out with actual information about ghost matter. Probably. Danger! Inside this fence is a pocket of ghost matter. A strange and impossibly cold substance that's invisible to the naked eye. The good news is you can detect it with a camera. Moving through ghost matter is uniquely painful and will probably kill you. Don't complain to me if you hurt yourself fooling around. Okie dokie. Use camera. I don't see anything. Oh. Go up and down. Hang on. 
I love how your shirt says I'm an unstable unicorn. I am also an unstable unicorn. <laughs> I, um... It's a card game. It's a card game. Um, what's it called? I forget the name of the company, but this is their main game. It was originally a Kickstarter. It's a really fun game. It also has um, a not safe for work expansion and a dra 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 dragon expansion and a rainbow expansion. It's tons of fun. Um, all right, so camera, ghost matter. I have honestly a feeling that it has to do with the crystals underneath, but I digress. All right. Um, there was just a wisp falling down. Information gathering game. The night sky background is gorgeous, like the orange and the blue stars and the slow rotation. Can you send me deets later? I will try to remember. Unstable unicorn. Okay, Google. Set a reminder for 10 p.m. to send Shay details about the unstable unicorn card game. Got it. Oh, <laughs> hello, astronaut. Good weather for your launch, right? That's lucky. What are you up to? Using my cinderscope to pick up the sounds from the distant planets. It's sent to out of wilds venture frequencies so I can pick up the traveler's music. Last night I heard Brian Banks banjo coming from Biddle Hollow. Hope that means they're safe. Here are different planets too. Depends on what time of day or night it is. It's different planets are in the sky at different times. Same scopes are cool. Whip. Fuck. I think I'm hearing the sun. Okay, so there's something about music with this game. Okay, so big one that whistles with the smoke. Smoky one is the whistling one. That. Pretty sure we're orbiting. Nope. Oh my god. Which one of those is it? That's that one. I for sure. Um, love. <gasps> More! Okay, that's the big whistly one. And then here's a banjo one. <gasps> Is that the deep water planet? Technically, it's all moving through space. Guess what, guys? Guess what? Right now? Right now? Right now, we're in space! Nailed it. All right.
And it has a little moon, or is that an asteroid? It said that it was... Just remember, part of you was once part of a star. Really nice. Haven't you been up in this tree a while? Mara will cut it down. Oh, this is the one. Very root house says Mara wasn't supposed to cut it down. I don't think they see eye to eye on this one. Um, I'll still watch your watch, though. If you from up here, I forget the voice I did for Maureen because I got so fucking mess. <gasps> the moon! Holy shit. What is that? What is that? What is that? Is that where I'm going? We are all stardust, so we all return to space once we die. I specifically would love my ashes to be launched into space, but who knows if that'll actually happen. Wait. Is that the... Ooh! That super explodey one has a harmonica! What about that thing beneath it? Ooh. Okay, I think that big white one is the one that we're going to. Alright. Ooh. Scout launcher. Aim launcher. Launch scout. So we'll all return to space once we die? Okay, I need to look at that post-it. Geyser Mountain. South Quantum Grove Crater. My ruin. Okay. Maybe all your questions will be, is there a time limit to this game? How the day-night cycle is so quick. I have a feeling that I'm supposed to be trying to take pictures of... Cool. Little bio from Google said something out twenty four. So many pictures. All right, this is cool. I heard something like that, but I also looked away pretty quickly. Ooh! I got it! Cool. Alright, I'm nailing this. I'm so good at this game. I'm such a professional video gamer! Look at the guys are behind me! It was so cool! Ah! Woo! Okay, nailed it. Done! I'm an expert. Yeah. It's funny how Reese is so diligent about spoilers when he's like fully sitting here. Love you. Sorry. Wait, wasn't I supposed to go to the observatory? Wait, no, but Hero G caves. Oh, right, to come up, to go up, 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 and then hang right when you get to the Zero G caves. So that's the observatory. All right, so that's the way we're supposed to go. We're gonna go this way. <laughs> hey, thought I might see you before the big launch. Nerves getting the better of you? Yeah, like you weren't a little nervous. I'm a little nervous, yeah. Um, be sassy. Easily. <laughs> it's a better story than Life is Strange. Easily? Wait, no, wait. I, I don't know if I need to play Life is Strange or not. I don't know. It seems like overdone at this point, but also it sounds really good. It might be sad. I think, but I can't remember if that's the one where I looked up the plot. I was like, nope, nope, nope. Your nerves are between you and me. The vast endless of space. 
endlessness of space. But really, you'll do fine out there. I'd worry more about the ship if I were you. Hopefully that lunatic slate at least fixed the retro rockets. So listen, there's a satellite. It's definitely not a piece of broken mining equipment. Set up down in the zero-g cave and in need of repairs. If you're looking for a little last-minute zero-g practice, head down the lift and into the cave. Or don't, so long as you're confident you can make ship repairs in space. Yep, I am on that. Try not to concuss yourself right before first launch. Is he missing an eye? I think so. Explore so much about friendship loss and just erg. I mean, before the storm is just gay shit, explore so much about friendship loss and just erg. Best story ever. Before the storm, is that a game? They're hard to compare, but this is a story you explore yourself the exact same way, pace, order you want, and not follow protagonist's view. I feel like, honestly, the way I'm going seems pretty like... I feel like I'm defaulting. I'm not doing things atypically, it seems. I am following what's in front of me one by one. So I, fe I feel like I'm not doing this in an unusual way, but... Ooh. So pretty. What about this is zero G? So pretty. Oh, Shay, I wish I could tell you all about how this... Okay, so this is tutorial land. Okay. Let's nail this. Zero G cave, zero G cave. Even The Last of Us? Hey, yo, my friend! How are you? How's it going? How was your stream? What were you streaming? I'm re I'm racing Reese to the shout-out. Let's see. Tom Clancy's The Division 2. Mo, hi, how are you? What's going on? All my little bit explosions. Capogen expl emote explosions. That's what they're called. It's not working here for some reason. Hi, shooty bang bangs, pew pew. I don't know how to pew pew. I'm bad at the pew pew. That takes me back. I've never played a Tom Clancy anything. Okay, here we go, guys. We're flying. Anyway, yeah, I'm playing this game. I remember when you were playing it. I was like, hi, I'm going to play this. Bye. Thanks for the shout out. Literally always. I got you. You're my friend. Down up thrust. Up. Okay. Up. Down. Up. Oh, it's just like the thing. Fuel. Me too. I had to see you play this. Everyone got me feeling bad for watching it. Well, this is all space and shiz, so it's super hard to compare. Oh, there's a gravity meter. Okay. That was all right. A little easier to control. It did win awards. Come back for me when it wins awards. How, how this game could be considered best story ever. I'm just- I think we're just trying to figure out why they're here, and then I'm supposed to go off planet and discover shit. Alcohol. Hey! That's you to drop down. Getting some zero chi time in? Give me the dirt. Guess where I'm going to give me the dirt! Fresh dirt! Not much happening. Out here lately. Let me think. Come to think of it, Nick Tight saw something crash outside the village crater earlier. That's new. That's different. Anything on fire? Probably only a little. Nick Tight checked out the crash. Since with the whole Firewatch Scout launcher, saw smoke, so they headed over to stamp out any leftover fires. Well, I better get back to work. This boat's not gonna mount itself, you know. Alright, cool. What's his name? Tough? Tough. Like to do research, but not trying to spoil too much. Even though, yes, I realize I'm watching Sarah's stream. Outer Wilds bought what a bunch of BAFTA. That's the British Acting Fire Acting Award, right? Yep, nailed it. Okay, so that's where. Ah, uh, no, where did I come from? I came from there. All right, so they want me to do that. Alright. 
That wasn't so bad. I hit the wrong button for thrusting British art and film acting fire. I can't... I don't know about best story ever, but one that immerses you far more than most. Imagine this is like a book and you could read the pages in almost any order and still feel like you've guessed it correctly. Still the tutorial. I am very slow. My apologies. Alright, so I'll stay up, kind of. Until I go down. Oh. Okay. Or not. Stay down. Average playthrough is 12, I took 17. Anyone watching the meteor shower in 30 minutes? But you're not playing Animal Crossing, I'm so confused. Oh, why do I feel like this is gonna be hard? Oh, because it is. Oh, okay. Yeah, are you talking about real life or are you talking about Animal Crossing? Oh dear. Oh, oh, fuck, fuck. Oh, oh, there. Press, press what to lock on? Press what to lock on? Press what? Holy fuck. Yes. Ah. Okay. Oh! Hold. No. Oh god. We're dying. We're dying. Oh my god, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. <gasps> I did it. I'm always on the wrong side of England for that shit. The match velocity button is your best friend. Gotcha. Oh, okay, because then I can, like... Roll. What's the roll? Oh, dear. Match velocity. Oh! Because I'll just... What's velocity again? My friend is watching from Germany. What made you want to play this, Sarah? Um, I remember... Bungie brought it to my attention, and then I saw, like, maybe an hour of you playing it, um, and everybody had been talking about it, and Reese was like, yeah, I really want to play this, and he's a picky brat, so I knew it had to be good, just kidding, love you. And then, Bungie talked about it some more, and then Morgan finally played it and was like, hi, this is one of the best games that I had the best time, and the story was so emotional and amazing, I feel so overwhelmed, I love the story. And I was like, well, Morgan, like, literally works in literature. So for Morgan to say she loves the story, that's some good shit. Where's the other Sparky Boom Boom? Lost is the speed. Or the direction matters, too. I got a D in physics. Oh, no, half of my fuel. Fudge. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh! I found it! I found it! Oh my gosh. I found it. Hold it. Yay, I did it! I'm the best. Oh god, I'm so turned around. I f oh, I just got so dizzy. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm going down, but I know I'm going up. I'm so confused. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh no. No, 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 no. Ha, ha, ha. Ooh. Anything, everything in space is moving, orbiting, etc. If you stayed exactly still, the planet would zoom off without you. So you match velocity is how you make things relatively still. Oh my god. That just made me like, ugh. Because I thought I was going down, but I was going up. Oh my god, my head like is going to explode now. Um, velocity is a speed where direction matters. How good this- Yeah, it did control well. Too well. <laughs> Too well. If you stayed still. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I noticed when I stayed still, I just- Things kept moving around me, so I got a little confused. Desi. Yeah, that threw me for a loop. I get motion sick, so pray for me. Usually you aren't in zero G. That's good. Yeah, um, I think so. So yeah, total success. I fucking crushed it. And then I 
eated myself back here so quickly. Oh, shouldn't I put it back? Turn. I... Yep. Get me the... Out of here. Planets have gravity. Lord. That was the time. God. Oh, flashlight. I have a flashlight. Hey! Yeah! Right, the flashlight might help. I forgot. I'm still, like, so confused and dizzy. Lord. Okay, elevator. Get me the fuck out of here, but it's cool you get to experience zero-g as well. It was- it was interesting. Like, I picked up on the I'm staying still and everything's moving around me. Velocity reminds me of when you're in Atlantica in Kingdom Hearts and you're like, fuck this movement, let me lock on and use that to move around. You know? Oh god, what was his voice? No, sit up! Of course, it'd be a little more stressful when you're hurtling through space. Just remember your training. Try not to hit anything big. You're itching to get off this rock? Get the launch codes for the observatory. Okay, um... Don't get yourself killed. Cool. Yeah, I forgot what voice I did for him. Okay, bye! I'm leaping! I'm busy! I'm not going to the observatory yet. We're gonna go this way. I want to see what's over here. Nothing! Okay, we're going to the observatory now. What's that? There's no noise on that one. Oh, that's that big white one. I think that might be where I'm going. There's a cool reason why that cave is zero G2. There's a cool reason for everything. You're a cool reason. <laughs> Boom. Crushed it. Can't go in here. But I can. Oops. Go on the roof. But I can. Go on the roof. Aha. Uh -huh. Can I do anything? Oh. But I can't go in the water. And up the waterfall. <gasps> I have an idea! I'm not going to the observatory yet. No, sir. No, no, wait. Hey, come say hi to your old flight coach before you launch. I've got zero G train to set up if you want a refresher. I'm gonna go back down there and. Wait, no. I doubt it will let me take the zero-g suit on the lift, right? We'll see what happens. I just... I have a stupid idea. I wanna try something. I wanna try... Wait a minute! <gasps> this isn't a cave! This is a tunnel! This is just a straight shot down to space! Right? No. Yes? No? Maybe? How do I get out? Okay. Here we go. Flashlight. Is it? I don't know. I'm reading too much into it. Just an idea, space elevator. Okay. Just want to try. Wait. Wait, did I return the suit? I think it returned the suit. Oh, that's a bummer. I was hoping to zoop up the waterfall. Not your conclusions, it's your thought process. <laughs> Well, it just, if, it just, how it got all dark and starry, it made me feel like I, I was... Made me feel like I was, um... Falling through a... Through a hole. Like how little kids would say, I'm gonna tunnel my way to China, and then... That's what I always imagined the hole to China would be like. If you dug too much, you'd fall. You'd be in space. Ugh. Ugh. Oh. oh, my flashlight's on.
Outer Wilds Ventures founding members clockwise from the top left. Ornfelds, Goss, and Slate and Feldspar. You're almost right, it's not the space part. Definitely a tunnel through. Big thanks to these additional founding members of our Outer Wilds Ventures, without whom we would have never gotten off the ground. Matthew Steinhauer. Ben Etherington. Where do you up the pie? <laughs> Darden Frith. On Cummings. Sean Shark Templar Farrell. Stephen Ursel. Ryan Omrecker. <laughs> Omrecker. <laughs> That's well. Outer Wilds Ventures, Timber Hearth's first and only space program was founded to explore the farthest reaches of our solar system. I was gonna say that sounds like 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 someone like leaving their signature from a backer kit or something. Timber Hearth. Uh, Feldspar was the first Hearthian to be intentionally launched into intentionally. I like the use of the word intentionally, because that makes me think there's definitely an unintentional launch into space. All oh, right, got chair thing from the very beginning. Completed the first orbit around Timber Hearth and later made the first of what would be many landings on our moon, Addle Rock. I think that's that white one. Okay. Hey, hey, it's my favorite astronaut. Launch day last, huh, buddy? The translator's tools inaugural flight tool. I'm so too ex too. So excited it's making me nauseous. Just think you'll be able to translate and then know my text you want. Anywhere you are. Two of us put in a lot of hours into inventing that tool, so don't break it, okay? Ha! <laughs> She's do not break it. This is not a spoiler as it connects to literally nothing in the story. There's an unmarked satellite somewhere in space with names, pictures, and a video from high tier backers. That sounds dope. Ugh, ignore me, okay? I I'm just nervous. I'm not even the one who's going out of space. How are you feeling? I am terrified. Aw, oh, don't let me make you nervous. You've been training for this day since we were hatchlings, remember? You'll do great. I promise. So what's the dirt? You here see the new you here see the new Nomad statue? New statue? You haven't heard? Gabbro brought it back with them from Giant's Deep, and Hornfell's just finished prepping it for display. This is it right here. Neat, huh? Makes me wish we could see what a real live Nomad looks like. But I guess this is as close as we'll ever get. Check it out. Looks like they had fur. Fur is weird. This is the first fully intact statue you ever found, you know? And for how old it is, it's in great shape. Oh, jeez, I, I got a little carried away there. Go on, you have a ship to launch. Take care of yourself. All right. There's remarkably intact statues carved by the Nomai, an ancient species who dwelled in our solar system thousands of years ago. The statue provides us with our most detailed look yet at the Nomai, who appear to have been covered in a layer of fur. Note the decorative jewelry that has been carved as part of the antlers. Although their artifacts and structures have been found on almost every planet in the solar system, we still have no idea where the species came from or what happened. It flies very fast. That's such a cool backer thing, too. Um... It, it looks so oddly peaceful. And it has a third eye, which makes me feel like there's some sort of psychic energy here. Ooh. Ooh, I love that. What? Gosh, okay. A piece of Nomai writing was essential to deciphering their unique language. Although the text is linear, no, my text branches off from a central point. Interestingly, each brand tends to be written by a different author. Thank you, I might check that out. Right, so... Untranslated, no, my writing. We're nearly ready. Felix and I have finished the construction, and she says calibrating this device won't take long. Wait, hold on. Oh my god. This almost... Has anybody else seen Arrival? I mean, that was circular... Circular... Circ, circular language? Circular... Cir, cir, round. <laughs> that was the circle language, but... It... <laughs> never seen it? So good, Bungie. So good, so meaningful. Love, love, love. Um, there was an alien language. Um, that kind of reminds me of this in... Not, not directly, but in a small way. Fortunately, the Outer Rock's lack of atmosphere will make calibration simple. After all this time, I'm thrilled to finally resume our research. Okay. Asava, Felix. 
And what is this? Doesn't want me to have that be translated. Aside from the dwellings and structures they built, the Nomai also made art. This decorative pottery discovered on Brittle Hollow. Some ancient Nomai art depicts strange animals, foreign celestial objects, and other subjects that can't be found in our solar system. It makes us wonder whether the Nomai originated elsewhere in the universe or simply had vibrant imaginations. Were the Nomai born in our solar system or were they born among the stars and planets? And if they were, why and how did they come here? These are just some of the questions we hope to answer through further Xeno archaeological Xeno archaeological expeditions. That's basic as fuck. Here, be meteor time. You're a meteor. Um, does that mean you're taking a poop? Did I guess right? That's a skeleton. See, it's got its its antler on the side right there. What you see here are parts of the Nomai skeleton. We can tell from their skulls that they possess antlers, quite unusually, and unusually, only three eyes. The Nomai body was most likely adapted for living exclusively on land. The differences in the- Oh, right! Meteor time! There's an IRL meteor shower. I, like, was not paying attention to that earlier. I was like, what? You mean a meteor shower in Animal Crossing? You don't have the game. Um, that's just their shockingly fragile bone structure. Shows us that Harthians couldn't have descended from no Mayan ancestor. It's not clear where the Nomai originated from or why they disappeared. We hope to find more clues to this puzzle as we explore our solar system. Excuse me. <sighs> The Nomai tech brought back from space by our astronauts has been a great boon to Outer Wilds ventures, allowing us to modify expedition gear in exciting and useful ways. For example, the little scout now boasts a warp retrieval capability that allows astronauts to recall their scouts almost instantly. This has dramatically reduced the number of scouts lost to the depths in space. I like that they're having an explanation for how I can just zorp something back to me instead of that being like one of those instances where characters like, and remember everybody, you can always press the R1 button to return to your launch pad. Anyone who wants to take a picture should get the circle button ready. Like there's an explanation for that. I like that. crystal was taken from a Nomai ruin on Brittle Hollow. Seems to create a local gravity distortion. It was most likely used to traverse steep surfaces. Try it out. I... Whoa! <gasps> Wicked! Making sound. Purple. Purple. Okay. Oh no. Oh no. Help. 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 Okay, we're back. We're back. We're back. <laughs> that was fun. Purple. <laughs> Okay, we are at that. Right? Pictures. I like the uh, the swirly designs like that. That's cool. Oh, the fishing! This anglerfish specimen was found attached to the landing gear of one of our ships that flew to close to the dark bramble. It appears well suited to living in dark places within with minimal atmosphere. So this is a flying anglerfish, i.e., the worst thing you've ever fucking seen. It looks like an anglerfish had a baby with a ghastly. Purple! Purple! <laughs> if our star is mass- if a star is massive enough, it will continue to fuse carbon into heavier elements like iron. Ultimately, the star will collapse under its own gravity and then explode in a violent event called supernova. Based on Chert's observation, this will be- one day be the fate of our own sun. Looks like I'm right on time for this playthrough. Hi, Neppy Crows, how are you? I'm, I don't, I feel like I'm not making progress, but I might be, I'm not sure. How's it going? 
As the star's core contracts and gets hotter, causing outer layers to expand, the star has become a red giant. When the core is hot enough, it starts to fuse helium into carbon. Am I going to be tested on this? Everything you learn is progress? Okay. So, am I missing... Am I supposed to start here? Probably. Stars like our sun generate light and heat by fusing hydrogen into helium. As it grows older, the star runs out of hydrogen and starts to contract. I did. Okay. And then... Then, as the star's core contracts, it gets hotter, causing the outer layers to expand. Their progress is a myth. The goal of the game is learning. This will be on the test. Gold star for me, right? Get it? Star? Get it? Get it? Get it? <laughs> Boom! That was kind of really fucking loud. Wow. I have broken all of my sound things. That volume. Let me just, let me just, let me just, let me just try that. Let's try that. Actually, no, I have it locally on the, on the button, so that won't. My volume's different anyway, never mind. Okay, so the store, the star contracts and it gets really hot. So then that center stays contracted and then the outer layers expand. And then it becomes a red giant when the core is hard enough. It fuses helium into carbon and then it goes boom. I missed it because I was too busy looking outside my window for meteors that are not there, Reese. Um, are you where there's a lot of light pollution, Shay? Watch closely. These balls move on their own. The ground is perfectly level. So what do you think causes this smoky motion? The answer is the moon. As it orbits our planet, the outer rock's gravity pulls on objects from different directions. In fact, it's pulling you right now. Dope as hell. Dope as hell. Ooh. I don't know. I saw something else I wanted to look at first before I do that. Okay. Nope, not that. This room. Okay, ready? Wait, wait, wait. There's more to learn down there. Usually you can't see it because of light pollution, but I'm not in the central city. I'm way down south near the country. Maybe it's just not the right time for you yet. Can I get up? I'm a papa, I'm a little baby, hop an alien. Hop a little, hop an alien, hop, hop, hop. Hee 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 hee. Wait. Wait. Hold on. I'm on. Okay, so I'm on this ramp, and there are three stumps. One, two, and three. I'm gonna go. Oh! Oh! It moved! Hi, lovely Neon Panda, how are you? Oh, what is this shit? The strange rock moving around in this grotto appears to react to conscious observation. The level-headed among us realize that there must be some sort of optical illusion at play, but Gabriel claims the rock exists in all possible states until it's observed, whatever that means. Whatever's actually happening, both sides of this debate agree the effect is extremely creepy. Hi, how are you? How's it going? I snuck up on the rock! Look at... Hold up. <laughs> you said between 12pm and 3am and it's 2am now, so... It could depend on where you are. See, we're learning. I'm good. How are you? I am doing quite well. This game is so much fun. I am so enjoying the simplicity of just wandering around and interacting with things. I'm gonna just... I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Watch this. Watch, watch. Oh, don't! I snuck up on it! Hey, yo, motherfucker! Did you see me sneak up on it? Did you see me? I'm so good. Hey, Rock. Hey! It won't move if I don't take my eyes off of it. We're gonna end the stream. We're just gonna stream this for, like, the next hour. Did it. Okay, let's go. Boom, there it is. Boom, there it is. Hey! And just think the game has even start. Really? <laughs> I'm so fucking slow, I'm sorry. 
Bungie said to make sure I uncover everything, so I'm taking my sweet ass time. Bruh. I'll know when the game starts. Doctor, excuse me while I continue to stare at my window for the next 10 minutes. I realize I wasn't wearing my glasses, so I ain't seeing Jack. Ugh. I hope you see one. Make a good wish. I hope it comes true. There you are! I just finished pre-flight observations. Local conditions are good. Time to get our newest astronaut off the ground. You'll be our first astronaut ever equipped with a Nomai translator, too. I confess, I've been giddy all day just thinking about it. Better equipped than ever to unravel the mysteries of the Nomai. You and Hal should be very proud. Tell me, what's your plan once you're in space? Um... So why are we so obsessed with the Nomai? Other than we took some of their tech. Dude, I've been waiting to see meteors or stars or whatever since I was a kid with the telescope. Oh! I've seen, I've seen many, many a shooting star and I saw Saturn once through a telescope. It was fucking awesome. It looked so tiny, but it was so detailed. It was so cool. I... I'm gonna learn about the Nomai. I might have guessed as much! No sense in making a translator tool if you're not gonna use it to translate nothing. We barely scratched the surface on the Nomai riding in our solar system, so we still know little about them. No idea if they originated here, or traveled here, or why they disappeared. Tools of that tool of yours should provide indispensable and solving the mystery of this ancient species. Well then, looks like that's all that's left to blah 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 blah. I'm ready to die in space. I'm not one for superstition, but isn't that kind of unlucky to save before a launch? At any rate, here are the launch codes. Try not to worry too much. Our ship's not every bit as safe as Slate should be could be persuaded to make them. Best of luck. Let me know if I can help you with anything. Launch codes. Oh, that's Morse code. Space is cool. Space is cool. Hello again. Something you needed? Tell me more about Feldspar. Feldspar was one of our four founding members of Outer Wilds, along with our flight coach, Gossin, Slate the Engineer, and me. As ground control and later, and later the museum curator, I didn't work with Feldspar as closely as Slate and Gossin did. I can tell you Feldspar was... I just heard a beep. I swear to God, I've been hearing beeps all around the house lately. I swear to God, I heard a beep. Absolutely fearless. Nothing scared them. Has piloted everything Slate ever built. It's a wonder filled spa on live to see space, frankly, but they did. Do all sorts of dangerous stunts and explode everything they can find. I hear a phone notification. I heard a beep too. I don't think it was my phone though. It didn't sound like my phone. It was the government listening to me. I mean, probably. This is America. Look for the stream where I read the sex part. Oh, the the. Stardust stream. I had a notif- I had a, um... I had a, um... Notification. Hold on, I, my, I, I was gonna meet up with Pat in, in, in Animal Crossing, but he doesn't know I'm streaming. Let's say hi. Hi! Hey. This is my way of telling Pat that I'm live. <laughs> Sent him a selfie. Right. And then one day, they just didn't come back. We don't know what happened, or where Feldspar went, or whether they're still alive. Yeah, cause cause Pat and I were gonna trade things at Animal Crossing, and he didn't pay attention to my schedule, so I just sent him a selfie. Do you want to see? You guys want to see it? It's it's a cute one. <laughs> I think I'm funny. Um, been a long time since they left. Was there something you needed? Let's see, Chirps on the Hourglass Twins. I back up Riddle Hollow, and Gabbro with Giant Steep. And then, Felspar, obviously, but of course we don't know where they are, or even if they're still alive, we think you're funny too. Thank you! It was a cute selfie. Whenever someone's like, where are you? I'm like, selfie, or if I'm ready to pick somebody up, I take a picture of their house, because I'm fucking creepy. I think I'm funny. Apparently, it's, it's, it's annoying, but as long as I'm amused. <laughs> was there something else? No, I am good. Um... Whoa! Holy shit. Hourglass twin. 
This is the one that was just going... No, that's the one that wasn't making sound. Yeah. What that is. Welcome to the map of things you're going to need to get very familiar with. This is my playground. Yeah, this one I don't think was making sound. This one was going... <laughs> and then this one was going... <gasps> no, that was... No. That was going... Right? And then this one was, um... This one had, um... Gordian. <laughs> I gotta go to all oh, this really does feel like it's set up like mist. This real I no, this part makes it feel like Riven, where there are different worlds and different books to explore. All those lanterns. Cool. I like the look of that one. There's a hole in it! It's really hollow. That's so neat. Then that's the the water one. I don't remember hearing that one. And this is the sun. Okay. Nailed it. Alright, let's get the fuck into space. That Morse code. Alright. Go into space. Yeah, I don't want to see that. It's Thank you. Bye. Launch codes. Beep, beep. Ha! Ah! Marshmallows. Is that my actual gameplay footage? I knew it was psychic. Third eye generally means a psychic creature in pop culture. Um, 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 where's a pen? 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 Launch codes, right? Launch codes. I'm gonna write that down. Um. In fairness, you have four. Don't worry, you don't need to write things down. Oh, okay. I just got so nervous. Oh my god. You know, Sarah, she loves to write things down. It really just... There's a log that stores the important information. It just reminds me of the... The setup of Riven, I think, is what's making me have an impulse to write down. Mm, this is odd. According to my redshift calculations, every single galaxy in this image is moving away from us. In fact, the farther away the galaxy is, the faster it appears to be moving away. It's almost as if the universe is expanding! Big Bang is real! But if that's true, everything was everything closer together in the past, and how far back can we extrapolate? Did the universe have a beginning? Oh, jeez. Gonna fuck with me. Hornfeld's observations. It's incredible. I thought the points of light in this image were stars. They're galaxies. And this image covers a tiny patch of the whole sky, which means the universe contains at least a thousand times more galaxies than we previously imagined. I missed this part. Okay. Freaking maze game? That was terrible! That was a fun game, I swear! I swear that game was so much fun. Riven! No, not Riven. Riven- Riven- No, wait. Riven was fun, but Riven was not a good game to stream. Mist was fun. Same. Yeah, I love the music. It's so chill. Hey, so did 
you get a good look at that Nomai statue? It looked and glowing. Why was it glowing? Whoa, whoa, the statue was doing what? I forgot his voice. Terrible. <laughs> Reminds me of Life is Strange. You love life? I don't know anything about Life is Strange. Please don't spoil, other than feelings. So, it's eyes open, and then you saw images from your own memories, like glowing lights and stuff? You mean like a hallucination? Listen, no offense, but are you sure you're okay to launch? Like, medically speaking? No, that statue's definitely weird. I mean, if you're saying it happened, then I guess maybe it did, but, but why? Hornfels tried everything to get the statue's eyes to open. Nothing like this ever happened to them. I don't think you're gonna get any answers from the museum statue, but Gabro said they're going back to Giant's Deep. Don't know what island they're on, though. Maybe they'll be able to tell you more? On the other hand, Gabro's, you know, Gabro. So maybe you're better off searching for more information on your own. Have you missed anything? I'm not sure. The game has begun. Yeah, will not spoil many feels. I'm really jealous of you going into space. <laughs> See if you can use a translator tool to find out more about statue, okay? Good luck. Safe flying. All right, I'm, I'm losing track of the voices, so forgive me. See, this is... Don't ever play it. Life is Strange 2 is all you need to know. My brother's story is all right. Life is Strange. Yeah, I've heard Life is Strange 2 is like a harsh time. Ooh, it just started. The epic adventure begins. Y'all say the game has started, but everything seems the same. I'm like, what's going on here? Last I saw, she was decoding shit. Something I can fuck up. I like that I started on a campfire and could roast a marshmallow. That was... Hello, astronaut! Are you... Wait, no, is this the kid? Statue did a weird glowy thing and she saw her memories. Right, Kefra was the kid. Kefra was the kid. I've only seen a playthrough of Life is Strange 2 and I wasn't impressed. Yeah, I've heard meh. Everybody's saying the game has begun. I'm like, what? All right, I forgot this was the kid. Let me try to remember the voice. Hello, astronaut! Are you going to space today? Are you going to space and never coming back like Feldspar did? Don't worry, I will come back. That's what Feldspar said too, but they never did. Hornfels will be really sad if you don't come back. Like how sad it makes them to talk about Feldspar. So you should make sure you don't get lost in space too. Alright, thanks, Vicky P. Um, check out this house. Yeah, that's the thing where it's like you could be a voice actor. I, I, I do the voices like once or twice, and then the more and more characters you introduce, I'm like... You're just starting the game because you're talking to people on this planet still. Yeah, this is my first time, first stream. This is our, we're, we're dawning on hour two. The kid is really encouraging, huh? Ooh, spoilers. Yeah, no, I know I'm gonna be in space. Like, just, just started. Dobby. Oh god, I'm a little astronaut alien. I'm back here again. Oh. Wanna see the best part of the fucking game? Check this shit out! Check it out! The tension control here is so good, like... Oh... A little bit. Is there a... Accomplishment for roasting the perfect malo? Nope. Most people never talk to any Harthians again. After leaving this planet, so I guessed. Are you alien or human? I'm alien. I'm a Harthian. Hold on, I'll do a look down after I roast this bad bitch. Oh, yeah. Good shit there. Ah! Ah! Fire. See, I'm blue. There's a trophy for eating ten burnt ones, but I made a good one. <sighs> Looks like you're ready for takeoff. The excitement of a launch is still fun and all, but I can't wait to get back to working on the new ship. Working on fixing the autopilot's avoidance system for this one. <laughs> Sorry. Nothing new. Is that it? Enter launch codes. I'm so excited for your launch. <laughs> Yay! Duly noted. What's duly noted? Oh, alien or human. There's a trophy for eating 10 pert ones. <laughs> Should I have done more tutorial? We're... God, this reminds me of Mist. Might get this on PS4 next week then. Hey, that's that crystal we saw in the museum. 
It's being jerry-rigged to make this fly. Oh, this looks safe. New ship log. A rock, ash twin. Riddle hollow, hollow's lantern. Rumor mode. What's up? Lunar ruins. You. The Nomai text in the observatory talks about calibrating some sort of device on the Adel Rock. The one and only Harthian village, as well as the main source of explosions on this planet, the Nomai statue in the observatory opened its eyes and looked at me. I saw strange glowing lights in my own memories. Al says the statue never opened its eyes before us, despite Hornfell's best efforts. A cave at the very center of Timber Hearth used by Outer Wilds. A new astronaut. I have repaired it. Okay, so this is my log. This is my stuff. Gabro. Gabro went back to Giant's Deep to try to learn more about the Nomai statue. Yeah, I had a feeling that Gabro was where I was gonna, um, look for. I had Jerry rigged. I'm always Jerry rigged. <laughs> Go into rumor on the ship log. Way easier to follow. Great minds, Shay. <laughs> Not that too. Not to pull anyone from a stream, but it's a game I suggest finishing on your own if you have interest in it. But before watching other, pe yeah, yeah, th like Ale Alexandra, like for like I'm all like, don't feel bad saying that. Like I'm for that. Fish and mailed. If you're planning on getting the game, don't watch much more. It's gonna get yeah. I know Shay. I love you, and I'd love for you to stay. But I also would love for you to experience this. Um, it's safe to watch a little bit more. Okay. Totally non-linear. Gabra went back to Giant's Deep. Okay, so this is my ship log. That mode. Okay, so rumor mode is like, I have information on some stuff here. This is where we are. And this is where a rumor happened. And then I have a rumor about Giant's Deep. Okay, so I understand. So this is where I have information on this planet. Um, so then rumor mode is like, here's the information that I have. Okay, I got that. Not the... Um... The game would be different, but it's non-linear. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Timber Hearth and Giant Steep. Alright, rumor mode is basically the only one I ever looked at. You forgot there was a map. Um, suit up. I don't think we suit up yet. I think we fly this piece of shit. Oh, look, there's a plant! That's so nice. Uh, flying a spaceship made of wood makes me nervous. Lift off landing camera. Oh, God. Um. Oh, God. Oh, no. Nope. Oh god. Lining flight trajectory. Oh god. Accelerating towards destination. Oh god. Am I doing it? Am I doing it? Am I doing it? What is the best space material? Welcome to space. Am I doing it? Oh god. Oh god. I think I'm doing it. Firing retro rockets. Why? Autopilot aborted. Oh no. No, we want that. Come back. No. 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 That looks like me. No! No! Oh no. Match velocity. Autopilot just gets you near. You gotta match it yourself. Land myself. And fucking where? That looks like... like me, though. Where'd that bitch go? No. Can 
I die. That. Jellyfish! Luckily, water is difficult to pancake yourself on. Oh, wait. That looks like land. Ooh, ooh, that looks good. That looks good. That looks good. Oh, oh! Exit ship. Repair. Landing gear damaged. Oh, thank God. Put away. Unbuckle. Did I land? Suit up. Can you die more than you know? Scared. How do I get off? Open. Flashlight. Okay. Like a glove. <laughs> a very hard glove. How do I fix it? What did I break? Oh, repair. Nailed it. Eating yourself into the sun by accident will almost certainly happen. I'm looking forward to it. Alright, nothing here. Alright, let's let's get going. Do I need this? I've done it more than once. I'll do it on purpose. Wow. Old. Oh. Wait. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Same. Is there a trophy for that? Surprise me, but not sure. I have an idea. They... It'll tell me if he's here because he's... He'll make music, right? Yeah. Don't use... Might be somewhere that way. Okay. Oh! Oh! Ooh, I have an idea. White ones are close, red ones are far away. Okay, hang on. I have an idea. I have an idea. We're learning! We're learning! my next idea this then launch it see what's in that direction oh no but it's already a few hundred meters wide if it's big thousands you're looking at a different planet gotcha okay Log updated. Okay, there's something to do up there. First, we're gonna look at this. Alright, once they're close, right or far away. Notice of gravity, that's very important. Yeah, my gravity thing. Oh! Shit! Shit! One's done the thing. Oh no, wait. Crystals. Those might make that ghost goo. I must say, the fact that you're using the zoom with the signal swap tells me you paid attention to the tutorials as I've seen people go through the entire game never using it. Alexandra, I took my sweet ass time with the tutorial, okay? I've already been playing like two hours. <laughs> um, right, untranslated. Statue workshop. Well, that sure sounds like something awesome. There. Oh... Yeah.
Oh, hello. Tick chick boom. Um, should I be nervous right now? There's a tornado. It's the best way to get used to the controls. Should I be nervous? Um, what? Um, 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 oh gosh, oh gosh. A space house to come get yeeted? Did I? Did I do the right thing? Oh god, burn it. Your options. Um, good jetpacking. You're good. You did a great thing. That was amazing. I did that. That wasn't like by accident. Mission mailed. There's, there's not really a wrong thing. But yep, that was really good. I did it like correctly. That's extraordinary. <laughs> okay. Ooh, statue island. Ooh, statue workshop. All right. So I start here, and this map... Yeah, okay, okay, okay. So this is my planet, and then this is... a different... Yeah, so that's the... That's the rumor about the moon, and then this is... Gabbro, and we're on the water planet. Whenever you see Shiplock updated, it shows up here. Task failed successfully. <laughs> you not dying was a good thing. Um... Island must be where Nomai created statues like the one in our observatory. I found one lying on the beach. It looks like the one in our observatory. Yep. Found a sign for a statue workshop next to a broken door that used to leak inside. Those tornadoes would indeed yeet you in the entire island if you're standing on <laughs> into the stratosphere. What? How are you supposed to do anything? Can I, like, leave without the ship? Without the suit? I feel like this isn't smart. Wait, hold on. <gasps> no! No! We don't like breathing. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's definitely me. Look at how long I stared at things. Is it gonna put me back to the statue? I'm looking at you, game. It was sooner than expected. I never disappoint. Please, give the people what they want. <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> There's a reason. All right. First things first, we're gonna do this properly. Oh yeah. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Eat. All right. I've done that once on accident too many times because I was so itchy to get back to where I was just exploring. But yeah, best practice is always have your suit on. I made it a habit just to wear the suit forever. Gotcha. I wasn't sure. Ah, I didn't know if it was just protecting me from the tornadoes or something. But apparently not. Oh, shit. Fuck. Maybe I'll get that burnt one. Oops. I genuinely didn't mean to do that. No harm in putting it on the right when you get in the shit. Does it replenish oxygen when I put it away? Oh, shit. Don't waste fuel or oxygen. I mean, spacesuit, different planet, different oxygen levels. What happens if I just... Ah, it poof. Uh, okay, I give up. Let me talk to you again. I need to get this thing off the ground. Did I just die? Whoa, bad dream or something? You still look half asleep. 
the negative on being deceased. I know it's tradition to sleep under the stars the night before a launch. But if you ask, it still makes y'all a bit jumpy. Also refuel both in your ship and right next to where the suit hangs and there's oxygen. Whenever you're near a tree, there's a panel in your ship to refuel it and medicate yourself. Okay, I didn't see that. Sorry, I'm like really not paying enough attention to chat. New people, I'm... Wait. Hold up, you're gonna want to get the launch codes from the observatory first. I already... Uh, no? You have a bad dream? Well, I'll ask you how you got the code, so hurry up and launch me before Horn Fells decides to ground you for medical reasons. I didn't find it until near endgame. Something to do with that statue. This is so weird. Alright, time to fly! I didn't find the eject button until after endgame. Okay, this is... Okay, is this the- this is the med kit? Suit up gear options. Alright. Nailing it. Alright, we are going back. You love the music? Yeah, it's so good. I'm really enjoying it. Alright, let's go! Get ready! Nope. No? No! Fuck that planet. Where's the... Shit. Where's the planet? Oh no. Why is the sun so close? You're playing... Ah! Aha! You're playing... Attention plenty to the chat for a game that's throwing much info at you once. Don't worry. Thank you. <laughs> Press the touchpad for the map. Now, why would I do something so simple as that? Why would I do that? Firing retro rockets. There's so much going on. Yeah, this is a lot. Oh, this is so much fun. Thank you for making me play this, Bungie. I would have played it eventually. Autopilot complete, but maybe not as soon, and I'm glad that I am doing it. Oh, oh, what is that? Is that an alien ship? Is that a... No! 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 Hold match velocity. Okay. Ah, oh, ah, oh, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. Put away, put away, put away, put away. The first time I get to truly see someone play it, blah, well, fuck, you've got no different place to Tom. I might have to leave you here, potentially. Yes, this is non-linear, bench. Oh, fuck. Oh my god, shit. Shit. Stop. Are you good? Is it done? Jesus, Sarah. <laughs> Remember when you guys were like, that was excellent jetpacking? Yeah, no, fuck me now, right? Suit up. Whoa. Health and fuel fill. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Open. Air. Bad. Any other part damaged? Signal scope. I don't know what that is, but I'm gonna fucking touch it. Okay. I'm just staying around for the thing now, to be honest, if she survives long enough. Okay. Watch this. Ghost matter. Yup! I fucking thought so! I fucking thought so. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this excellent gaming. Yep. Freeze.
I'm in a giant tree. Look it. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Hide. Oh no. Oh no. Pay attention to your gravity. Pay attention to your gravity. Pay attention. Why does it eat you to space? <laughs> you know, fun fact, I used to live at the very opening of Tornado Alley. That's what I thought would happen for the first time. I don't know what that is, but I'm gonna touch it. This is the Oh my god, I can't end this at 10. Fucking crazy, this is awesome. Oh my <gasps> god, this is so good. No, fuck you. I am- no, I'm going right in there. Nope, nope, goodbye! East. We are going. Go. <laughs> this is so good. Did she die? Yes, again. Yeah, this can't be allowed just to end just yet. No, it's it, I'm I'm busy. Busy. I did. I died a second time. Okay. Where's my water plant? Like Morgan said in her tweets. So many nights staying up. Solve the mystery. Gauge autopilot. Hell yeah. I'm like, what the fuck is fun? But I have work? Ugh. So good. Right. What if I like changed my stream schedule? Gotta get to the meats of the game. I want all of the meat. What happens if I unbuckle while I'm flying? Yeah, no, I might. I just might. This is too good. Oh shit! What was that? Did you see 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 it? Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Okay, okay. Oh. Wait, those things are down below too. Okay. No. Yes. Exit ship to repair. Headlights damage. Landing gear damage. No. No. No! I see it! I see it! I'm coming! Nailed it! Stop. Did I do it? Am I down? Did I do it? Did I get it? Did I get it? You're gonna kill the ship. You just stop slamming your ship down. How do you... Is there a special landing thing? Alright. Something else is broken. Probably that. Sorry. Yep. Just go down slowly. Ow. Did I fix it yet? Oh shit. Cool. Nailed it. Oh, I know how to do that. Open. Instead of putting downward boosters on max. Oh, I thought that was how you went. <laughs> Genuinely my bad. Alright, hang on. Is there anything else broken? I think I'm fine. Anyway. Let's continue. Bye, ship. We'll see you again. What? I'm gonna stand near it. What's this? 
Wait. Nope. Nope. It's entertaining to see Sarah slam the ship into the ground. <laughs> this is painful trying to tell what's going on with Sarah getting without getting spoiled. Um from skews. Pick up. Pick that up. Put it in the fucking hole. Woo! Right in! Velocity matched. Too close to target text. <gasps> Ooh! Go, go, go! No, 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 no. This is it. We finished building the final orbital probe cannon with module and are ready to send it into orbit around Giant's Deep for assembly. Our next step will be to send Privet up to orbital probe cannon to install a tracking system. To all my friends here at the construction yard, my gratitude for your tireless work. I had given up hope but truly believe this cannon may actually succeed where other attempts have not. Are you going gelatinous on us, love? I'm delighted by your words, but they're atypical for you. Her lover, ooh. If I'm ever half as gooey as Malo and aliens behave together, Daz, you may launch me from the orbital probe cannon. I know my brother Evans and his spouse will want to launch the probe with as much power as possible on board the cannon will break under the strain. Suppose we give Evans and Mallow a slightly lower maximum power setting than the absolute <laughs> maximum possible to create room for their enthusiasm. Okay. Plug updated. Okay, so I have that saved. Okay. And what the fuck are you? Oh my gosh. Okay, so big cannon getting launched on all three islands she found on the first time she's been on them. Liffy! Wait, Liffy got to see two though? She's good. I think she's okay. Did she get launched again? What fuck it? Maybe when I return to Stardust. Aww. Yeah, tornadoes. Really bad luck. I have the worst luck. I think I'm okay now. Getting launched on all three islands she's found on her first time. Yeah, okay, so that isn't the intent? I thought that was the intent there. Okay, so they were building an orbital probe cannon, and then there's one specific team and his lover named Malo who were like, hell yeah, explosions. And then the rest of the team was like, no, um, they're a little explosion crazy, so let's fucking be careful. Oh, this is the orbital cannon. Okay. Gods of you getting launched that consistently is basically zero. <laughs> uh, I'm special, what can I say? Um... Gravity. <gasps> oh. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Hold it off. <laughs> yeah, of course it did. I'm me. I don't want to be over here. The other side looks cool. Oh! Oh, I see it. I see it. No, no, no. I went the wrong way. I went the wrong way. Hey! This is gonna make me vomit. Oh, this is awful. Oh, God. Oh, yeah! I'm hurt. Yeah, we did it! We did it! We did it! We did it. We did it. Right. Seven minutes, six seconds ago. Long range probe successfully launched from orbital probe cannon. Ship log updated. What? What is. Pick up control module projection stone. Insert. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Um, I have bad news, David. Zero says there was a problem with the proposed power source to the Oprah 
Over a cannon won't be asked to fire. Who's orange? I hope you're pulling my locomotive limb here, Casava. I wish I were my friend, but no, they aren't certain they can fix the problem, so the orbital probe can is on indefinite hiatus. But tell Privet and Mal they should return from the cannon. My spouse and I will remain at the construction yard for now. An orange person. An update, Mal and I will join you in Dad's prevent left to visit her brother. She fears I did may feel responsible. Then Actually wow! launch. Okay. I Crunch. I need to get back, like, yesterday, though. God. Get back. I need to get back. I need to get back. I need to get back. I might not make it. 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 I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. There's more stuff. Oh, bring me that. Okay. Sorry. Sorry. How do I go home? Oh no 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 drop it just drop it just drop it down drop it sit here it's fine we'll be back okay okay here go 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 run 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 and boom ah swimming swimming go up go up 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 oh help 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 trees help 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 Oh, oh, do we get? Help, 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 help. Oh, God, oh, God, oh, God, oh, God. Oh, oh, yes. I don't know why I'm here. Ah, ah. I don't like this. I don't like this part. Oh god, it's making me feel like I'm drowning. Please detect an oxygen tank refilled. But I'm gonna get so hurt. Ah, go for this one. This one's not broken. Those gravity wells are practically the safest thing as you'll always stick to them unless you jump off. Gotcha. Oh no. Okay. I need to heal myself. Oh, this is weird. Oh! <gasps> Late am I? I don't know what those activated. It was fucking awesome. <laughs> what happened to the gravity? I don't know. But I'm getting back on the ship. We're fucking leaving. Just kidding. We are not leaving. I'm gonna use a med kit. Baller. Turns. I was wondering what those were for. Yeah, hang on, phone internet is acting up, switching to PC. Launched the fourth time, but did I, to keep you safe if your island gets launched. So I did the right thing by going in the pipe? That was awesome. Oh, it was so cool. Okay, hi Adam, this is a very, very cool game. Oh, my statue. Statue workshop, okay. So, no, go back in. All right, orbital probe can. Nomai finished building. These are Nomai? The safe house? Oh, right, I was saying, fun fact, I played, the, I was, we lived at the beginning of, of the tornado alley. I am so spaced out. This is so good. Oh my God. No, my finished build. I, I was saying, I was like, fun fact, I used to live at the mouth of Tornado Alley, and I never continued that thought. I just dropped it. Sorry, guys. Oh my god. Gravity walls. Yeah. So I, I boosting upwards while you're sideways is bad. It was bad. And I noticed, I noticed when I got back in the water again that the one to the other side of the main area didn't have a gap in the middle that you had to jump. So I was like, oh, yeet myself over there. I shattered dreams. So funny. Okay, sent it to orbit around Giant's Deep. Oh, that. The island is where the Nomai bit the or 
built the orbital probe cannon. For some reason, they put the orbital probe cannon on indefinite hiatus. The cannon was not asked to fire. According to a know by computer, a long range probe was recently launched from it, though. There's more to explore here. There's sure fuck it is. I only just got a notification. Um, I did, I was live for like five minutes earlier, and then I had to restart because stream crashed. Yeah, there sure fucking is more to explore here, bitch. Alright. Is it looking particularly stormy right now? Let's go outside, spin a few hours, but very leisurely. 80 to 90% is spent on timber hearth. Wait, does Adam know about this game? Which way is that going? Um, I'm gonna go where I know it's safe. Down here. Very leisure, yes. Yes, because then I have this thing. Alright, so where did I not explore? Oh, oh, okay, here we are. Alright, nailing it. Doing much better. Oh gosh, oh gosh, please don't, please stay on it. Base magic survival. Base exploration much death. Yes! It's a mystery exploration game. Yes, it's very cool. I still have no idea what the fuck's going on, and it's awesome. Alright. Where are you going? Drop it? In the bowl. Somewhere. No, does anybody want this? Oh, it probably goes back on that thing. Oh, gosh. Okay. Oh. We are bringing it. I sent you a funny tweet on Messenger. Gotcha. I will check. Not right now. The Nautica looks scary. <laughs> oh, you're so funny. There's a bunch of interconnected mysteries around an ancient race and other planets in your solar system and you have to uh explore and figure them out non-linearly yeah okay here we go already holding but move that drop it drop it that up watch this boom hmm. Ooh, story Conoy, Daz, and I were lifting the orbital probe cannon components into orbit for assembly, and one somehow sank down beneath the current. Passiva convinced me not to try to recreate the phenomenon myself using other cannon parts, but we're very curious to know what happened. How could something pass through the current? My gratitude for your interesting question. This is exciting. Fire constructed a model of Giant's Deep here at Brittle's Hollow Southern Observatory and it reveals how an object might sink below the current. How do I am unable to grasp the answer by looking through the projection pool? If I visit the observatory, would you kindly explain? If you don't mind the trek beneath the surface to the south pole, I'd be delighted to see you. Railhead starts at the Brittle's Hollow's repair. Nope, nope, nope. Oh shit, fuck, 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 where is it? Ah! Ha 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 ha! Learning! Biggest start in this game is yourself. This is more story driven than Subnautica and you don't get weapons or anything. I'm gonna sh give you Subnautica, sister. <laughs> I've- I've- Subnautica's another one that's been on my peripheral, but IDK. This one just seems way hecka cooler. I'm loving this fucking game. It's so good. So good. Hey, I learned though! That was cool. Oh no, you should have seen it! We thought it was impossible for any cannon components to sink even partially below the current, but our sank through to the core. Uh, South Pole, Brittle Hollows, Equator. Ship log updated. No. This. And out of 10 would wipe memory to experience again. Adam, 
Adam was born in 1997. Maybe I should get very drunk so I forget all the spoilers I know about this game before I play. directly at the ground to get the part. That's it, that's the thing, that's the thing, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. See it? You see it? That's it. That's the thing. Where'd that go? No. Hold on. I'm almost out of oxygen. Fuck. There are trees nearby. And a skeleton. Yay. Now that I have a desktop steam sales, oof. Uh-oh. Tornado. God. God, oh god, oh god, oh god. Go, 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 go. Oh god. I saw it coming. <gasps> Remember to boost upwards if you're falling so you don't break your legs. Right, right, right. They're not spooky, scary, sailage. So freaked out. I'm so freaked out right now. <laughs> so freaked out. Oh my god. Hi, Zandric. How are you? I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. I'm freaking out. Hi, Adam. Thanks for the 16 bits. You're my brother. That's gross. I love you. Goodbye. I need to go use the med kit. I'm not done there. I'm not done there. This why is, you oh my god, people were talking about Subnautica earlier. That is too funny. That's too funny. That, oh shit, fuck, fuck, fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. No, no, please no, please no, please no, please no, please no, I should have Thank God. Okay, we're in here. We're fine. Oh god.
Help. There we go. <laughs> well, Nicole and Jerry can do that. Oh my god. What did I say? Grab it. Blast off. But why? Fuck me, fuck me, fuck me. Oh. <laughs> Blast off, why? Blast off for now, you'll see. But there was something I wanted to see. Ocean current discovery, southern observatory, ocean depths. Never mind, Subnautica had more of a production value. Blast off. Okay, okay. We're gone, blast. Exit ship to repair artificial gravity. Oh, I fucked up. Um. Do what you want to do. If you regret, that's your choice. I can't believe I was so lit off of one kill. Flicker drink. Don't worry about it. You can still launch. Okay. Lift off. Artificial gravity dip. Big! What's that supposed to happen? I think I fucked it up. I died! <laughs> We're in space! <laughs> space! Yeah, when I, I... I used to take... I used to take Adam to car washes a lot. And I love the part in car washes when it's, it's air drying your car to get all the water off and the droplets just like... That was a supernova. Oh, my be. That was a supernova? What? Specifically, your son's supernova. Am I the only person experiencing this? Bro. There's our pilot, ready to get off the ground. You know the ship is a death trap. Let your lucky have a time loop because otherwise I'd be super dead. Um, yep. Ah, uh, you're lucky you don't I have you grounded for- I don't have you grounded for medical reasons because I have no idea what you're talking about. Alright, motherfucker. I'm gonna go scream at everybody now. I'm gonna just... Nope. I'm gonna let her figure it out. How did you know? The one time when Sarah first got in her car when I was in high school, we had sibling car rides bonding time and she took me to a car wash. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah! And in the drying phase, the water uh, droplets look like a Star Wars Star Wars hyperspace effect. Sarah has entered Karen mode. I've entered Karen mode. Oh no! <laughs> I'm gonna go yell at everybody. We're in space. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember. I remember screaming in my car. And went, We're in space. <laughs> hey, yo, Hatchlin. Heard you leaving us to see adventures amongst the stars. When you return, you, me, Gosson, open up a bottle of the good stuff on the good side. Okay, another metaphor ruined in the name of scientific accuracy. Nevertheless, I hope you enjoy your travels. Alright, so it doesn't seem like everybody else's dialogue is changing. Yeah, that's the same dialogue. I recorded some of it on my old phone, although it's been one of the better, if not defining, highlights of our siblinghood. I miss our sibling car bonding rides. I'm gonna head off as past three am. Bye, Shay. You will be a- you are a star. You wanna see a shooting star? Look in the mirror. How about that, huh? Talk to the guy at the campfire. I've been here a while. Her knowing now is for the better. <laughs> Where's the manager? <laughs> I love you, Adam. That was my spam. Not spam. Quality story. As a pilot, a uh, death trap, but a really powerful death trap. Why I suddenly care about safety? Yeah, motherfucker, I'm gonna head off now. I've <laughs> seen all I wanted to see of Sarah's reactions. The sun's gonna go supernova. Oh, yeah, the observatory has an exhibit about that. Between you and me, glossed over some of the finer details. Astrophysics is really more Hornfeld's domain. Me? I'm here for the rocket science and the marshmallows. British gang out. Peace. Goes off. Whoa, 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 whoa. Did 
see what this is. Just restart it. Okay. There's our pilot! <laughs> um... <laughs> going forward in time of loop. Just sped up time for a bit. Alright. I was wonder- I was just wondering. So, did you know- Oh, that's why y'all were like, Oh, it's been about two hours. Okay. Wait, how do you save this game? Does it just like- You just- It maintains its state? Is there saving? Where are you? We are not done with that. We are not fucking done with you. Mm -mm -mm. Um, don't quit mid loop. Saves per loop. Only thing that shaves is your ship's log. Wait, so is now a good time to stop, actually? Every time you add the ship log, it begins. Saves whatever you learn, but you come back, you start at the beginning of the loop. Even the saves in this game have in-game lore. <laughs> That's funny. So would now be a good time to stop for the night, actually, though? Like, really? So since I just got back into Dead by Daylight, the Steam sale has it on sale. Also, I'm kind of fucking stuck. What did I do? What I just got here. Alright. Can you pull yourself away? Ah. Apparently not! <laughs> Apparently not. <laughs> we just want to let you quit before seeing the sun go boom. Can I pull myself away? No, but should I? That's the real question, because I'm hurt. Oh. Oh, hang of space flight eventually. <laughs> Wait, what is that? That's new. Honestly, even if I do stuff right now that doesn't save, I wouldn't my I wouldn't mind uh I wouldn't mind doing it again. Great, firing retro rockets. Why it's so far away. Oh. Oh.
Did I do it? <laughs> Stumbles back with fear. Be careful, that was a lot of faces in a very short time. Um, do you want Subnautica? I'd gift it to you, but I have a feeling I'll just shove money into my PayPal's recompense. Um, if it's available on console, I'd rather do that. Let's fucking get Lady Machitis! I successfully landed on a comet! Hell yeah! It's still just because the comet's so small and everything was moving around it, I was really unsure. Good job, Interloper has very low gravity. Yeah, that hooked. <laughs> it's available on PS4, I think. Adam, you do not need to do anything because I know you're like not working properly right now. So please don't spend money on me. Okay, there's no gravity. Oh, fuck me. Um. Oh dear. Oh, okay. This is like Subnautica meets No Man's Sky. You're still getting paid ice ice, baby. That was just... Try this again. It meets something like Oprah Den. That's something I, 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 I keep seeing that and I'm like, I don't think I'd like it, but it looks interesting. Okay, go on the rocky bits. Dope. Dope. Oh my god, this is so cool. Okay, be careful of those bits. And then we go and jump, and then down. Nailed it. Good, but not for anyone. My brain really hurt. It looks really cool. Gently, gently, gently. Nailing it. Oh my god, I'm so good at video games. I wanna be in here. Ooh. 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 Oh dear. Oh no. Oh, 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 we are going for it. Oh, we are going for this. Oh, I'm doing so good. Oh, I'm doing so good. Bro. Bro. This is troublesome! It seems that the comet wishes to submerge our shuttle in ice. If we stay on the surface too long, the shuttle may freeze entirely. Like a good warning. Um... Is that it? There was more. Oh dear. No, no, no. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Oh, no, gently. Gently, baby, gently. Oh, you're okay. You're okay. There was more. Shuttle may freeze entirely. Oh, even if it did. Couldn't someone call it back home to the gravity cannon on Ember Twin? Yes, but the exploration of the comet would be more difficult if we were without the shuttle until someone recalled it. Perhaps we shouldn't have landed on the dark side of the comet. Someone... Suppose one of us reminded, remained in the shuttle to keep it warm and continue monitoring the surface. That would be wise, I think, Clary, if you don't mind waiting here for it. Oh, can I can... Investigate... Surface. Okay. Like a good warning, the interloper is there. Of all the locations we had our comic conventions, the students who volunteer in San Francisco were the most entitled and whiny. Oh, Xandric, that sounds rough. Wait, something's happening to me. Something's happening to me. What's happening to me? <gasps> what? No! Fuck. Did I do it? Um... <laughs> oh! We're just gonna slide around. No, please stay down. Please stay down. My ship! Fuck! No! No! Oh wait, match velocity. Easy. Oh! Well, she's not dead. Are you fucking sure? Did I make it into the 
a ship. I didn't think I did. Oh, suck to Oh, ouch. Okay. Oops, big oops. So if I were to stop now, would it save here? I did make it into the <laughs> Several pieces. Oh, the trap. Huh? <laughs> the tractor beam sucked my <laughs> Oh my god. I am gonna- this is gonna be a long playthrough. This is gonna be a very long play- Oh. Oh, I have to go to bed. I'm having such a struggle. I wanna go to bed. Fuck. Why do I have to work at a job where COVID's making us so busy? This is so good. It'll be so worth it just to sure to continue. Oh. Oh my god, no. Like, I'm already, like... Anybody who was looking forward to Twilight Princess and, and Birth by Sleep on Saturday, you got another thing coming. That's That shit ain't happening. Alright, I gotta- I, we gotta figure this out. So we'll play it on Thursday. And then on Saturday... I'm not a hundred- I'm not gonna finish it tonight, there's no way. Cause- cause... We gotta work up- we gotta wake up at like 7. Work. I work in pharma- pharma marketing. So it's like... It's intense right now. Um, even if it's not tonight, yeah. So, I think my plan is play a little bit on Thursday. I will bump stream up on Saturday. I will start early. And we'll f can I finish it? Like, say in my ship things, I work at 7. Oh my god. Thank you. Thank you for doing what you're doing. I, I really appreciate you. Honestly, anybody working in sort of... You know, anybody who is able to do anything in any capacity, because... This is a crazy time. Oh my god, fish and mailed Alexandra. Thank you for following. Did I miss an alert? No, I didn't. Okay. Because my alerts have been kind of broken lately. I just ship board games, nothing special. Um, I love board games. Do you know about Unstable Unicorns? I'm wearing an Unstable Unicorns shirt. One of my one of my peeps was asking about it earlier. Um, so yeah, I think I think the plan, I think the plan is I need to tear myself away before I'm up all night and, and Jerry's like there, what the fuck? Uh, um, this is so good. What the fuck? This is so good. Okay. I do not hours we do ticket to ride Katia in a pandemic. Ah! Oh my god! Ticket to ride. I love ticket to ride. I, I like Katan, but I am not good at it. Um, so I think what we're gonna do is I'm gonna tear myself away now as much as it pains me. I've lightly caressed two plans. You have a long way to go. Sleep needs to happen, yeah. Me staying up late tonight will not make as much progress as it would... Would, like... I want to stay up late, but me staying up late, that effort will not equal the same amount of story, you know what I'm saying? So we'll play a little bit more on Thursday. I will start stream early on Saturday. Maybe we could finish it if I start by, like... What do we think? Like one? But I finish it by dinner time? It's gonna be quite a few streams taking your time like this, the ask money way. No. Maybe cause like do I wanna make myself finish it or do I wanna let myself like enjoy it and take my time? Oh I'm so ah! I'm so stressed out. It's so good! We gotta find somebody to raid though! What are we gonna do? This is gonna be quite a few times. It will be time consuming. Take your time. Yeah. Because you can't enjoy this a one-time experience. Enjoy it. Don't rush it. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I'm just... I'm just... It's so good and I just want to, to, to play it. You know? Oh my gosh. Oh, Bungie, why would you do this to me? Do we have anybody we want to raid? Resident Evil. Big Leaf is streaming, just FYI, for this exact reason. Yeah. Okay, then I'll take my time. Maybe, what if I did a Sunday stream again, even though I said I needed a break? Oh, there's someone playing Outer Worlds. There's someone playing Outer Worlds. What if I, what if I raid someone playing Outer Worlds? Wouldn't that be so funny? That would be funny. Get it? Get it? 
get it because similar do it yes it would from outer wilds to outer worlds i think it's hilarious um i think that's hilarious <laughs> you'll look back on this wish and you could feel this again it's amazing like the discovery the mechanics i can't believe i had the nerve to complain about first person controls it's so good i remember we had confusion in this chat about them yes we did uh i'd like i don't even want to but I just, I know that if I, like, try to push now, I won't get to experience it as richly, but I just want to play it. Oh, poor Outer Wilds, the coincidence that ruined their sales. Yeah, anyway, we're gonna read Besso. I can never say it, YT. Member of the Plan Army, playing Outer Worlds. We're playing Outer Wilds. Hopefully somebody thinks that's funny. Um, you guys, this has been a great stream. I'm so happy I started this game. Ugh. Oh. People who are ready for Kingdom Hearts are gonna be so mad. <laughs> Not all of them, though. Looking at you, Bungie. Anyway, yeah, um... This is so good! I have nothing else to say other than this is so good. Thank you for experiencing this with me. And not minding that I'm like, ah! <laughs> You're lovely, what, glad I stumbled you upon your stream. Thank you! I, um, I'm what, gonna... What? I, I am glad to have met you. I have a Discord as well if you want to bother me on there. I can be on there a little bit during the work day. Don't tell anybody. Um, if you want to chat, also I have social medias that I hold myself out on a little bit. Um, sometimes I tweet at midnight about Harry Potter. That's exciting. <laughs> anyway, I don't even know what to say. This has just been so good. And the conversations with everybody's just been so good. All right, I have a raid message. And then if you're a sub, you can use sub raid. Thank you, Adam, for reminding me. We just gotta go. I'll see you on Thursday again with this game because I have to change my fucking schedule. All right, Mwah. bye. <laughs> good night. Nice meeting you.